back to another video. Like I said, we're gonna go ahead and review the beta for Mortal Kombat 11. So let's go ahead and get right into it. As you can see, the gameplay to my right or my left, wherever I decide to put the video down below us. As you can see, this is actual footage from the actual beta that came out about maybe two weeks, three weeks ago. And as you can see, there's a lot of things going on here. The combat system for Mortal Kombat 11 is just as good as it was last time, but ten times better than ever. We also got the new campaign that was announced, in which case both dimensions of old of the past and the future, or, pa or, or past and present if you want to go that way, um, have collided, in which case we have to bring back the balance to make sure that the universe is aligned and every, all good and evil stays where it is, and this new threat that has emerged is defeated at any cost, in which case becoming allies with our past selves tends to be the only option we have. As you can also see, uh, when the kind of, as the time this thing goes on, you have the fatal blows, which are even much more deadlier than you think. Um, they take off a chunk of health, and it's just unbelievably crazy how much damage that puts into a character. But best believe, if you have the chance to ever run those things, make sure you definitely fucking run these. That is crazy damage. When it comes to the variations, of course, um, they have not struck with being able to do whatever the hell you want with them. You can customize them any way you want. You want a symbol to make it your own little type of style. You want to rename it, go ahead and rename it and do exactly that. You have the different variation qualities and the customization to be able to do whatever you want. You want to make your own special little scorpion variation work case. You are a god when you use the kit over here or the hellfire or any of those sort of moves. You can do that. You want to combine them. You want to do damage. Go ahead and make your own variation. This is where it's at. This is what Mortal Kombat should have been. But you know what? I never complained about Mortal Kombat before. It's had a nice run of games that have been successful for years. In which case, this is no different from impressive. This is no different than shy of absolutely crazy. And I could not have done it any better. NetherRealm Studios is doing a phenomenal job. And I hope they continue to do this work to the end of the time. In which case, now we can move on to the fact that these are fatalities. Look at these fatalities. Holy crap, these things are crazy good. They're more gory than ever, they're more brutal, and they're not even they're not even shy but impressive. You got so many different types of fatalities coming up with the fact that these are only like six characters, unfortunately. But with the six characters that were available for this game, uh, the beta for the time, it's definitely showing you, hey, there is more to come. Just imagine the different qualities of fatalities you will unlock as you can progress in this game. And who knows, maybe you might even make one yourself. If they have customization of fatalities, that'd be something different. But no, this game is absolutely crazy. I cannot wait for the release date. I've already pre-ordered mine. I got the premium edition, which comes with the whole season pass and stuff like that, so I'm ahead of the game once again, baby. Um, and that, that just, I'm just so excited, dude. Um, I even bought myself a little something-something to really show off the hype. I'll have my friends record it once we go to the premiere for the game when it comes out. And you guys, I hope you guys will like it as much as I will. But, uh... What do I think of the of the overall game when it comes of like the beta? Well, in consideration, people in this game, as you can see by just the videos that are coming up, some of these videos I'm not winning, and some of the videos I'm I am winning. But by the looks of these videos, um, you can definitely see that some people for these days have not improved their combat for Mortal Kombat in forever since Injustice 2 came out. In which case, all I'm seeing in the in this beta at the time was spamming of the same exact move at an annoying rate, in which case I couldn't move, or I just couldn't, you know, not get hit, or I can even land a hit on them myself. In which case, you have to adjust yourself to the point to where, where you actually have to play the same exact type of way that they're playing, in which case it just ruins the game because Mortal Kombat has so much to offer. There's so many different combos you can unlock and do, and do so many awesome things to other people. But these guys in the time of being the, in the beta, they just chose to be mediocre and not very impressive with their fighting styles, and I wish that they would do better. Now, when it comes to things I wish that they change, um, the damage that they give Baraka. Baraka's damage is ridiculous. It's, it, it takes away like half of your health by 50% each time he uses a, spe a specific move, in which case he will stab you and he will leave his blade in you, in which case it will make you bleed longer. And I think that needs to be buffed down, like, a lot. That's a ridiculous amount of damage done by one character in particular. Same with Cabal. He needs to be nerfed a little bit, too. He's, his attacks are just way too much. Um, they definitely uh, nerfed Scorpion down to the point to where if you want to play fast pace and 
you know, make sure that you're never getting hit or that you want to, you know, be unstoppable and get a flawless victory, it's a little bit challenging this time because guess what? They definitely made sure that he wasn't the strongest one this time. But that's okay because I have adjusted to Scorpion um, in this beta. It took a while to figure out how to play correctly with all these people were doing the same exact moves and pissing me off with the spamming. But eventually I came across the good fight in which case this guy was very was a very good sport about it and me him faced off as Scorpion versus Scorpion. And these fights went on for hours and it was absolutely crazy that I actually managed to find one person in the game that actually understood the concepts of how to fight half fun in World Combat. So if you guys are the type of person that's really competitive in this game, just remember, have fun with this game because if you're gonna get mad, it's gonna really upset you and you're gonna wish you hadn't. And it's not worth getting upset over with this game. It's Mortal Kombat. This is what it's been about. It's been about playing the game and having fun with it. And if you get over competitive, that's fine. But at this situation, you should always remember, this is just a game. This is nothing important but just a game. It is for everyone to enjoy, in which case, you should not shy away from being a gamer yourself and playing this game for yourself. So, this overall rating for this uh, for the beta of Mortal Kombat 11, considering it's just the beta and there wasn't much offered, unfortunately, except for a miniature ladder, which case is very awesome, and the multiplayer being all, uh, also opened up, and the variation showing you a, similar, a little tiny taste of what is to come when you get the game itself. Uh, I rate Mortal Kombat 11's beta a, uh, let's give it an 8 out of 10 just for the fact of the problems that I received from it and the fact that it's just not complete. So, but uh, nevertheless, is it worth getting when it comes out? Absolutely. You should definitely try this game out when it comes out. Please do. Um, yeah, that's really all I have to say. Um, you just, if you want to continue watching the video of uh, more Mortal Kombat clips, here's the thing. This isn't the only Mortal Kombat 11 clips I'm going to upload. I'm going to upload all of them on a giant montage so you can find out the different types of fighting styles that there are with different characters. Mainly, I'm going to be Scorpion all of them, unfortunately. I did not play any other ones. So, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you're going to get Mortal Kombat 11, leave in the comments below on which character are you going to main. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Fight!